the weather features on the map. Okay, props to them because they released this without even telling anyone, really. It's kind of like a last minute type thing that they threw in. Yeah. We weren't even expecting it. And right. it, dude, it is way better than I thought. I, when I saw that, you know, there's a weather feature. I was like, okay, that's cool. I didn't know really, really how that would play. But when you go to the map, it feels different. Like dude, it's like quieter or something. I it, don't know. It really kind of, I like honestly, out of everything they've done, that actually makes me feel like I'm in Texas and there's like a thunderstorm going on. Yeah, I don't know why. It's it is a lot more immersive. Yeah, it's almost like it added like a quiet element to the map, and then you hear the rumbles in the background. Yeah, and it's creepy too. Yeah, right? I love it. I think uh, is is. <laughs> small of a change i mean it's not huge like they don't have like rain or anything it's just like a thunderstorm above i think they nailed it i think it's great well and what the bigger thing is and i think we're we gonna get into that later the things that be this is going to tell us that there, there's going to be future changes like this coming oh well, yeah i'll guess, just i'll just go over right now it's a great so way to is, say i could have just said there's going to be other weather elements yeah <laughs> just could have but yeah. or you could say it like that again <laughs> He lifts tree, he runs into walls. That's what you, <laughs> it's what you tree. expect. You know what I mean? <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go over the quote that actually Wes gave talking about these features and the future. So what he said is, we are working on, and if you, sorry, if you don't know who Wes is, he's the CEO. Oh, good call. Yeah. So he said, we are working on weather for Texas. <laughs> I don't know why that part bugged me. Because they're talking about the game, but he said TX. It should be uh, to me. It should be TCM. Yeah, Unless, but you know, even in the Reddit, it's TX they put on there, don't they? Uh, maybe they do. Okay, know. so they're working on weather, uh, thunder, rain, etc. So again, right there, they're already saying they're saying there's going to be rain coming in, which is funny because if you remember back, they actually said they weren't doing any of this. Yeah, it was interesting because they did go into pretty detailed reasoning why they didn't want to do it. Like they're talking about how it would be really complicated, especially with the rain and the mud and the footprints. Right. Which does make sense. The question is, I don't know if they're still going to, I don't know if they will do footprints and like muddy footprints, that type of thing. Yeah. Oh, because this one, there was a weather feature, but there's no real effect in the game because of it, right? Other than it's dark. Yeah, it doesn't thundery. affect like the ground. No, no, no. And the interesting thing is, like you said, the fact that they brought up footprints and stuff, though, would make me think that they would be putting that in the game. I personally feel like if they're going to do these weather environments, that they will. Because, they, you know, everything they do is really detailed and they think out everything. I think there will be like muddy footprints. And I would I would expect, too, if it's rainy, I'd expect like water going in the house when you go from like outside in. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, hopefully. But again, that's just one aspect is rain. Will there be snow? They said for sure they weren't doing snow before, but I, I'm starting to think they're messing with us and they're telling us stuff they're not doing and then they'll do that. And the stuff that they said they're going to do maybe aren't going to do it at all because I haven't heard much about museum mode. <laughs> Guys, let's have a chat here. <laughs> let's have a little talk because I was thinking about this too. And dude, you know how we are. I'm such a creature of the moment too. I'm just happy to get good new stuff. But I started thinking about, it. I'm like, oh, dude, this is awesome. And it is. I love all these changes they're doing. It's great. But what about museum mode? Yeah. <laughs> what happened? Well, isn't it weird that like they just put something in the game. They never talked. In fact, like, like we just said, they literally said they're not doing it. But all that stuff they said they were going to do, they just aren't talking about it. Yeah, the 90 days of and this isn't like criticizing them. I more just find it inter entertaining. It's a, <laughs> it's a little bit of a critique, but like the level cap hasn't been talked about in a long time well well that, but that wasn't so we we had a 90 day promise right well you know it's a lose promise but they had a 90 days where we're gonna get a bunch of content and there's still a bunch of stuff that was not in that 90 days which is funny and then they come out with this and it's like oh, okay that's awesome but what about that other stuff we're just not talking about it i guess so and you know what at this point i don't really care about museum mode as much i think the weather events is awesome so i'll give them props for it but we probably need to talk about that at some point <laughs> I think it'd be cool to do a community check-in just uh, now that everything's <laughs> now that everything's a little more chill and people are happier with the game, just do a little check-in and like, I want to know what the roadmap is for the rest of the year. Dude, we're almost halfway through. Like I not mean. just like theoretical roadmap. I want to know like, yeah, for sure. We're doing this, 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 and this. Yeah. Like museum mode is going to be out next month. This is going to be out two months. You know what I mean? Dude, I'll tell you what, that, that every other week content drop is awesome. <laughs> That Wait, is we've cool. only had two weeks so far, but it's cool. That is cool. Now, uh, let's get back on track here. Sure. So you'll get the first glimpse. This is again, Wes talking in his quote. You'll get a first glimpse of our work with this map. You can see the storms in the distance. Future maps will have rain with some intense storms. 
Ooh. That's interesting. This is not a dynamic weather system, but a bespoke, a bespoke one for each map. What okay, so the weather, it sounds like the weather's not going to be like changing up during the match. Oh, so it's not dynamic as in, in the match, you're not going to get different weathers. Yeah, I think weathers. it's that system is on that map. Like, yeah, it's like we you're have, playing the rain, the rain version of Family House or something. Yeah, yeah, that's what I would say. Which I'm totally fine with. Dude, actually, I mean, dude, this is awesome. I'm, I'm getting excited thinking about intense storms. Just think about how interesting it's going to be when you go into a map and it's like Nancy's house, but you're in the middle of like a, some rainstorm and you can't see far. Like that's going to change the game. It's a way for them not to do new maps, but to make cool maps and a lot of them with relative ease. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, like again, the Nancy house change wasn't a change in, I heard anyone really asking for having the night map and it's been awesome. Every, everyone I've talked to likes it. Oh yeah, I think I think overall it's a really good, great change. <laughs>